What's good YouTube, it's your boy Vega. Today we're gonna be talking about the top five spring and summer shorts that are going to be in my rotation at all given times. These are shorts that I kind of gotten throughout the year and some of them I also got recently. Some of them are bargain deals and some of them are also a little bit on the hype lane. Either way, I have shorts for everyone in this list and I think that it can help you out. And at the same time, I'll just show you what I'm gonna be rocking. If you haven't done it by now though, go ahead and subscribe smash the like button it really does mean a lot and also hit that bell that way you get notified every single time i drop a video but with that out of the way let's get right into it all right guys let's get right into it so last year i did a video very similar to this i went ahead and talked about my summer shorts rotation i talked about all of the shorts that i was rocking back then and all that good stuff this year i wanted to go ahead and start it off a little bit early and talk about it in springtime because in spring we do rock shorts right so this year i wanted to go ahead and talk about these again because these are dope i mean we're we are still rocking cargo shorts but specifically nylon cargo shorts and these are from paxson and they're called the cargo nylon shorts they're very good i like these so much i have them in every freaking color green navy blue black khaki they look good trust me what i like about these is that the pockets are in the front instead of in the side like the traditional cargo pants and um these look good man like trust me in person they feel good as well and the fit is on point so nowadays we are rocking shorts a little bit sh on the short side a little bit more above the knee and these fit the same way i think it's like a seven inch in inseam if i'm not mistaken but these are dope i rock these in some of my lookbooks some of you guys uh, also dm me through instagram asking you know what these are as well and uh, yeah these are very good i highly recommend them the price range is anywhere from like 26 bucks all the way to like 45 because paxton is always doing deals and depending on the color you might have a better deal here and there so packs on cargo nylon shorts is something i'm gonna be rocking is something that i highly recommend and you really cannot go wrong next in the list are basketball shorts so with basketball shorts is something that i tend to rock a little bit more in certain years than others because it's something that you got to be careful with like if you don't rock the shorts right you're going to literally look like you just came from playing ball or you're going to play ball and that's not the vibe that you want when it comes down to basketball shorts and sometimes i just rather rock a nylon cargo shorts because some people just don't get that vibe so when it comes down to basketball shorts i'm going to talk about two things really quick and the first one is the traditional michelin s uh, basketball shorts these are the swingman shorts the difference between uh, these and the more expensive michelin s basketball shorts is that you have pockets so the swingmans have pockets and they look and feel good to be honest with you you're gonna pay you know around 80 bucks for them but i feel that it's still a good vibe just make sure that you don't rock like a beat up tee <laughs> make sure that your t-shirt is on point make sure that your sneakers are more maybe on the high plane or if not rock air forces or something like that or runners just that way you don't look like you're about to go play ball you just got to be careful in how you rock them if you want i can do maybe a video and how to rock basketball shorts correctly that way you don't look like a freaking bum but either way michelin s basketball shorts is one way to do it or you could go a little bit more in the plain side this kind of reminds me of uh eric emmanuel shorts but when it comes down to eric emmanuel shorts man they sell out quick and i cannot get my hands on them i don't want to pay resale for basketball shorts because i rather rock cargo nylon shorts right so these are probably a banging deal right here these are actually how much are these can you give me one second all right guys so check out the price these are 1390 13 dollars $13.90 for some decent basketball shorts these are from champion of course this color specifically is one that i highly recommend they are a little bit on the long side, so I don't recommend that you sag them. I recommend that you rock them correctly, or if not, you can always fold this right here and just make them a little bit more in the short side. That way they look good. When it comes down to these shorts, again, you just wanna make sure that the rest of the outfit looks good because you don't wanna look like you're about to head to the gym. But these are on point for $13.90. But these, I got them on Amazon, to be honest with you. And I was going through like my Amazon stuff, and this was actually recommended by Amazon, which I don't know why, because I haven't looked for shorts in Amazon, but 
whatever. I got these $13.90 in this yellow color, which in my opinion looks very good. They also have a green color as well that looks very on point, but you really can go wrong with this. You're not going to break the bank. So these shorts right here are something I would recommend or these, or if you want to spend the money, go ahead and get some Eric Emanuel shorts. Either way, basketball shorts is something that I'm going to be rocking this spring and in the summertime. The next pair of shorts are a surprise for me. I actually wasn't even planning on getting these, but I got them and to my surprise, they fit, they look good. If you like anything that is like a vintage wash or any kind of vintage stuff that reminds you of like 90s, 80s even, this is it. Like this right here is a pair of sweat shorts. These are called the Vintage Wash Black Volley Shorts from PacSun again. And these are dope, man. The wash looks very on point. They actually truly look like a vintage pair of shorts that probably my dad used to rock. And now I'm gonna rock them. What I like about them as well is that they have these uh, cream strings, which breaks the black as well. And the wash, man, the wash just looks very freaking clean. They have a little bit of a split right here in the side, which in my opinion looks very clean and nice little touch. You can rock these with like runners or Jordans, like specifically more like Jordan 4s or Jordan 1s, a vintage T. And yeah, that's pretty much a good look right there. These are for $35. They have a bunch of volley shorts. So if you like sweat shorts and you want a good alternative to like a fear of God essential pair of sweat shorts, or you don't want to pay that much, these are actually pretty good and they are actually true to size as well. So a good pair of sweat shorts is something that I'm going to be rocking in the spring and summertime. I talk about the fact that when it comes down to sweat shorts, if it's a, a hot day, I'm not going to rock them, but for early mornings, in the springtime is still cool. This is something I'm gonna be rocking. So if you're looking for a pair of shorts that is a little bit more breathable than the sweat shorts we talked about, a pair of nylon shorts is the way to go. These right here are from Champion. It has the Champion signature logo right there with a hint of red, which in my opinion, complements the shorts very well. The side uh, zippers right here are very good in the pocket area. I feel that it looks very good as well. It's kind of a crinkly nylon material. And also the whole pair of shorts inside is made out of uh, mesh or it has mesh better say, which is a good thing for, you know, for our balls. These are very good, man. In my opinion, these are very clean. They hit for $40. They also hit above the knee, which is a good look as well. They are true to size. Some people say that it runs a little bit on the small side. I am a large and I bought these in a large. They, they're, they're just a little bit tight, but if I get an XL, it's just gonna be too big. So I'm just gonna rock with these. If you want something different than the traditional Paxson nylon shorts, or you don't wanna buy like Nike nylon shorts, then this is a good alternative. You could probably get th these in a lot of places like Urban Outfitters, straight from the Champion website. And again, for $40, you really can't go wrong. All right, guys, so it's no secret, I love Fear of God Essentials. I like how the clothes fit, looks, I like the vibe and meaning behind the brand. So it's no secret, no surprise, better say, that I had to include a pair of Fear of God Essential shorts, but these specific, the black nylon Fear of God Essential shorts is something I'm highly going to recommend and that I'm gonna be rocking a lot for spring and summertime. These came out like two years ago. I think they are like 70 or 80 bucks or 90 bucks, something like that. Um, they have restocked a bunch of times. And yeah, man, these are, th these are clean. If you like Fear of God Essential shorts and you wanna know a little bit more on sizing, on which ones to get and all that good stuff, I actually did a top five Fear of God Essential shorts video that I'm gonna be rocking for spring and summertime. So I'll have the link somewhere around there. Either way, this is one of the ones that I'm gonna be rocking. They have a 3M logo right there. So when the light hits it, it's just gonna shine on you. It has a rubber essentials logo, the string with the lace lock. They fit very well. They're not like crazy baggy, but they're just a tiny bit baggy. They fit above the knee. The only thing that I wish that these shorts had was the mesh lining, kind of like the champion shorts that we just talked about because Let's just say this, you gotta be, you gotta understand the underwear that, you, that you're gonna be rocking with these because if you open up your legs like that, bro, if you're sitting down and you just go like that, I don't know how to explain it, but let's just say that your balls are just gonna be all up in the, all up in the air, you feel me? Um, and if you're walking and you don't have mesh, then that also means that 
your balls or your dangling is just gonna be basically rubbing up on that. So it's just not a good vibe. So just, just be mindful of that. My dangling. Either way, these are great. These are in the hype lane. So if you want something a little bit more pricey and more hype, then I highly recommend the Fear of God Essential Shorts right here. I mean, you just can't go wrong with them. All right, guys, that's pretty much it for today's video. Remember, I'm gonna have links in the description down below for all of the shorts that I went ahead and talked about today. I think that this list is pretty good. Um, it's something that I'm gonna be rocking definitely all throughout the spring and summertime. A little bit of everything to have like a little bit of a variety going on instead of just rocking the same old thing over and over. That gets old and repetitive. So you should be able to get something out of this list. Whether it's the champion shorts that I talked about for $13.90 or whether it is a pair of Fear of God Essential shorts. I mean, there's something for everyone. So either way, man, I hope you enjoyed it. If you found it informative and entertaining, go ahead and subscribe, smash the like button. It really does mean a lot. And also hit that bell. That way you get notified every single time I drop a video. Also, if you're not doing so, follow me on Instagram at carlosvega101. I'm always updating the date and time on my videos. And it's just a cool little way to keep up with me as well. So with that being said, till next time, peace.